Are there many pythons to choose from? If you are wondering like this, just hold on. Else, if you have heard these terms regarding python, you may already have asked that question yourself. What do these terms mean for python? A programming language is like an instruction manual, a specification of what to do and how to do that. Then someone needs to implement that specification. Being an open source programming language, different such implementations of python are available. C python is the official and the most common implementation. When people just say python, usually they mean this one. It's written mostly in C, and that's why the name. Easy for you to write C extensions for your Python code. If you're just a beginner, stick with this. Or if you need interoperability with C, this is your thing. Or if you just need Python, you can forget everything else. Jython, written in Java, and runs on JVM. You can integrate your Python programs with your Java code. If you need such an interoperability, Jython is for you. Iron Python, similar to Jython but written in C Sharp and runs on .NET Virtual Machine, makes your code interoperable with C Sharp. If C Python is written in C, Jython in Java and Iron Python in C Sharp, PyPy is the Python written in Python. Confusing? Well, but it's almost like that. PyPy brings just-in-time compilation to Python and that makes this the fastest Python. Again, because of its open source nature, anyone can repackage and redistribute their own Python too. Distribution means the Python implementation and the essential library and tools packaged together. These are three of such popular distributions. The official distribution maintained by Python Software Foundation. This is the bare minimum distribution. Comes with C Python and a standard library of essential packages. And you can later add any extra third party packages as required. Active Python, distributed by Active State, comes with C Python and bigger library and additional tools. Commercial support provided for enterprises. Anaconda, another major C Python distribution with commercial support focused on data science purposes. Python was first released to the public in 1991. Later, version 2 was released in 2000, and, version 3, in 2008. For some time, they have been updating Python, under two version branches, Python 2 and Python 3. Eventually, Python 2 development stopped by 2.7, and now we have Python 3 only. 2.7 versions are still available, and may already be in your computer. But note that they are not recommended anymore. Use the latest stable Python 3 version for new projects. That's 3.9 as on August 2021. We checked out some popular implementations and distributions. There are several other choices as well. Choose a distribution or implementation, based on your specific requirements and needs. If you're not sure or don't care, official Python may be the best choice for you. Whatever be your choice, it's always good to write new programs using latest stable versions of Python 3.